Look at the camera. Hello everyone and welcome to a special video. And it's always special when Anya joins us. Hello everyone. So what are we doing today? This video will be called Polish Girlfriend Reacts to UK Rap. Yeah, I'm excited. You are from Poland, yes? It's true. That is correct. And we'll be reacting to something more from my culture and my ends, I would say, to use the UK slang phrase. And today we're reacting to actually a song by a rapper called Polski. What do you think of that name? Interesting. Is he from Poland or...? <laughs> of course. <laughs> okay. he's, uh, he's still a... I would say he's a UK rapper. Okay. With Polish roots, but definitely he's, he's like from the UK and you can hear it from his music. Uh, he's been on my radar for a while. Like he's up and coming. So I want to see how you react to this music. Maybe tell the people, do you even listen to rap? Not really, to be honest. Polish so rap? No, definitely not Polish rap. If rap, then sometimes like Kanye West or... Nice, yeah, Kanye is great. Yeah. So we're going to listen to Polski and the song is called Culture Clash. Okay. So if we translate that to Polish, it would be like Starcie Kultur. It's a common phrase, a culture clash. So I guess he's talking about his two cultures clashing, like his English side and his Polish side. Okay. Are you ready to listen to the song? For sure. And let's see if we can learn some UK slang while we're listening. Yeah? yeah. Let's do it. Ooh, I like that one. What are you thinking so far? It's good. I like the the sound, like mm -hmm. the, the melody. Yeah, the sound is really good. I think from like whoever is the engineer and just the way he's rapping and the beat selection, I think he's found a really good sound because it's just very, for me, it's just very nice to listen to. But I had to stop here because he said a lot of the fam could have ended up on, it could have ended on Jeremy. What do you think he means by that? A lot of the fam could have ended on Jeremy. A lot of the fam, I mean, fam is like bro or like friends, yeah? Mm -hmm. That's what I know from you. <laughs> uh, but could have ended on Jeremy. Um, they could have ended, end up mm -hmm. on, I don't know. Okay, Jeremy. so when he says fam right now, he is actually speaking about, I think, his real family. Oh. <laughs> so when we say fam, it's like, your fam, usually like to a friend. Yes. But in this case, I think he's speaking about his real family. Okay. So it can be used like that too. And Jeremy, and it even says Kyle, Jeremy Kyle is a, it's a TV program in the UK mm. where like, Pathologicznie ludzie przechodzą. Like the worst cases of people with like family dramas. Like he cheated on me and I don't know if he's my, it's his my baby. Or like <laughs> just crazy situations mm, and family dramas. And they, they go on that show and they have like ugly teeth, but it's just the crazy people with problems and they kind of, Jeremy Kyle, he's like a therapist and he tries to help them on TV. Okay, sounds like ukryta prawda or trudno But it's real. Yeah, I know, it's but real. It's real. It's a bit like, if you know, if the, the American version is like Maury, I think it's called Maury, or Dr. Phil, uh, yeah, one of those. Uh, but Jeremy Kyle, he, so he says a lot of his family could have ended up on that show. I don't think we have a show like this in Poland, but it's interesting. Yeah, let's keep listening. <laughs> Eight. 
I want to make your business, business is no way I should wait. Wanna get paid, this isn't a way. Uh. I never went up to move your body. I was in youth, I'm calling a trolley. Bro, made bank supply in the month, that's why and brown like Pablo and Woody. Jeez, are you are you keeping up? It's hard to. <laughs> it's hard to keep up for you, yeah. Yeah. Definitely. I mean, he he's flowing fast, and obviously the the he's using a lot a lot of UK slang, UK lingo. So let me try break it down for you quickly. You tell me what you think. I never went country. In the UK slang if you say you go country or you go country it means you go to the countryside okay like, like vies mm, like village okay and that means you go to sell drugs in the countryside that's like a typical place to go because there's not much police there and it's not hot okay so interesting you said i never went country uh, i was at uni fuck all in the trolley so he was at university fuck all means nothing fuck all okay. means nothing like what did you learn today fuck all nothing and trolley is like a shopping a big shopping cart basically so he was at uni he was broke he didn't have anything in the shopping basket ooh i'll break this one down as well bro made bank off of supply and demand those are some business terms, so he's bringing it back to business. That's white and brown like Pavel and Walid. What do you think? Try break that down for me. That's white and brown like Pavel and Walid. The so, lyrics are on the screen. That's white and brown like Pavel, like white like Pavel, because Pavel is probably a white person, and brown like Walid, because maybe Walid is like a name for brown people. Yes, a typical white person's name, Pavel, Polish guy, a typical brown person's name, like Walid or Walid or whatever. Uh, but what he means is white is cocaine. Oh. And brown is, I think, heroin. So his bro made a bank from doing supply and demand off of white and brown. So he didn't go country. He didn't go country, but his bro went country. And he made bank from brown and white. Like Pavel and Walid. I would never guess that. Crazy. Maybe, maybe I'm not really into like drugs and I don't know like why brown is like heroin. I guess, like, I guess someone can confirm that for us, but I think it is. It's crazy. I've, I've, I guess maybe it's I've the never color seen, of it. Maybe I've never seen one. So. I haven't seen it either, but his bro made uh, bank off uh, supply and demand. That's white and brown like Pavel and Walid. Cold. You like it? Yeah. I, li I mean... <laughs> Oh, he coming in with Polish. So you're going to help me now. You would think that he's playing for it. Okay. Okay. Pierwszy sezon, 40 goli. First, first season, 40 goals. Okay. Okay. And that's his, I think, I've been hearing that a lot. He, he always says 4-5. Four, 4-5. Five. Four, five. That's like his number or something. Maybe. Ah, whole town of clash of cultures. So the whole town of London town is a clash of cultures. So he's not only talking about himself, but London. It's a clash okay. of cultures. And you know it's a clash of cultures. So many cultures and different people in London. What is like... Vultures. Vulture is that bird that comes and eats like dead flesh. Sempi? Semp? Okay, yeah, yeah. Vulture. Whole city full of vultures. It could go off at any time. Mm. If something goes off, it's like a bomb. It explodes. The whole city is full of vultures. It could go off. It could explode at any time. Something crazy can happen any time. And that's what London's like. True. Okay, it could so, go off at any time. So here we go, like... London town got too many loonies. What yeah, is loonies? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Loonies is like crazy people. You're a loony. You're crazy. Okay. You're nuts. London town got too many loonies. What is asylum? Asylum. A mental asylum is like that hospital for mentally sick people, basically. Okay. 
around in town, got too many loonies Starting to feel like a mental asylum You know it's peak when I look at the week, don't feel like a dog, you more of a vibe House down there is a couple of milky rolls down that way, marching the line he said on one street you can have a house worth millions and three streets down, three streets like keep going and uh, yeah it's crazy let's okay. just say can I have one more question? yeah yeah because uh, I know like entitled is not the like super hard word but I just forgot the, what, what it means if you're entitled you think you deserve stuff okay like privileged yeah you think mm. you're like privileged and like oh like Okay. So you're gonna get humbled quick if you're too entitled. Where mm -hmm. he's from. You know it's peak when I look at the week, don't feel like a dog, you more of a bad. House down there is a couple of milky rolls down that way, marching the lash. Get humbled quick if you're too entitled. Shit so big, I'm losing focus, moving side to side to side. Botanic fashion coaches make it bounce at any time. Way too many times I had to let go of my pride. Could go off at any time. Why do you think he's losing focus, moving side to side to side? What's your interpretation of that? Mm, I don't know. Maybe if you're in that kind of environment, like it's very changed, like cultural clash, like he said, uh, it's hard to be stable mm. when you just move side to side. Like. Right, like this way, that way. Oh my God, like crazy. Whole city full of vultures. And what do you think of the the music video? Yeah, I think it's cool. It's yeah, cool, right? I, I mean, I was like more um, focused on lyrics, mm -hmm. <laughs> but yeah, I think it's it's cool, professional, and uh, definitely. Yeah, it's really nice. Proper London vibes. <laughs> True. And there's obviously he's uh, Polish and uh, British. Obviously he's more British, I think. Just, just you could tell by his vibe. But uh, and there you go. I dropped a comment, bro. Polish as well. We're gonna have to react to this one. It's crazy. Uh, but do you think he should rap more in Polish? Because he just gave us a little bit. But I'm trying to see what he can do a bit more. Yeah, like I said, I don't really like Polish rap. Mm -hmm. So you prefer <laughs> uh, this? Yeah, I prefer this. But I think like if if we make some Polish, um, the, there is always uh, like uh, the way to be proud of Poland and mm -hmm. just maybe more of it. Maybe uh, Polish people would feel more mm, connected to it, hundred percent, proud of it. So I want you uh, to rate this one though out of ten. How are you feeling it? I think it's uh, nine. Nine for me. Uh, I mean, I really appreciate the fact that there is no like stabbing. There is no like. <laughs> Fair play. Yeah, like. I think he kept it real. You know, he was yeah, kind of honest. Yeah. Honest about his feelings and everything, because you know, if you, if I, when I imagine, especially like UK rap, it's usually about like stabbing people or <laughs> wanting to stab people or. Mm wanting to kill people or just like drugs and everything and he was like just introducing himself so i didn't go country and he was yeah. honest about that yeah so i appreciate that uh we definitely want to see more from polski i'm very excited for the next real quick camera died but we're very excited for the next drop and we're gonna keep listening to polski and see what he's got next with the music yeah, yeah. can't wait all right you lot if you want to listen to that tune the link is in the bio, so go go check Polski out and show him some love, especially if you like this tune. And love if you like people. this reaction, you know what to do, you know what to do. We'll see you on the next one, yeah? Go show him some love, go show us some love. See ya.